with 16 million foreigners flying in the country each year, Thailand is Asia's primary travel destination and offers a host of places to visit. Travel to Thailand and you'll find that despite this vast influx of visitors, its culture integrity remains largely undamaged. Thailand is a country that cleverly avoided colonization and has been able to absorb Western influences while maintaining its own heritage. When we talk about the history of Thailand from 1932 to 1973, it was dominated by military dictatorships, which were in power for much of the period. And the succession of military dictators followed Prydis Auster, under whom traditional authoritarian rule was combined with increasing modernization and westernization under the influence of the United States. The end of the period was marked by thumb and resignation following a massacre of pro-democracy protesters led by students. When we look at the travel facts of Thailand, its population is approximately 63 million, made up of ethnic Thais, which are 75% and Chinese, which are 14%, with the rest comprising mainly immigrants from neighboring countries as well as hill tribespeople. talk about religion, Buddhism is a national religion, Islam the largest minority religion, but nearly all Thais also practice some form of spirit worship. Now let's talk about the most beautiful places to visit in Thailand. Number one in the list is Bangkok, for sure. The clash of tradition and modernity is most intense in Bangkok, which forms the first stop on almost any itinerary. Within its historic core, you will find replendent temples, canals and markets, and the opulent indulgence of the 18th century Grand Palace, downtown's forest of skycrappers, shelters cutting edge fashion in decor boutiques, and some achingly hip bars and clubs. Number 2 in the list is Ang Mai. If you are wondering where to visit in the northern uplands, then start with Chiang Mai. It's both an attractive historic city and a vibrant cultural center with a strong tradition of arts, crafts and festivals. Self-improvement courses are a strong suit from acoustic mediation to Thai cookery classes, while the overriding enticement of the surrounding region is the prospect of trekking through villages inhabited by richly mixed population of tribal people. Number 3 in the list is Samui Archipelago. The peak of the coasts are in the south where the Smui archipelago of the Gulf Coast ranks as one of the best places to go in Thailand. Koh Samui itself has the most sweeping white sand beaches and the greatest variety of accommodation and facilities to go with them. Koh Phra Nagan next door is still largely backpacker territory where you have a stark choice between desolate covers and Hatran, Thailand's party capital, the third remotest island Rocky Kothao is acquiring increasing sophistication as Southeast Asia's largest Thai training center. Number 4 in the list is Central Plains. With Chiang Mai and the north so firmly planted on the independent tourist trail, the intervening Central Plains tend to get short strip. Yet, there is a rewarding trekking around Amphang near the Burmese border and the elegant ruins of former capitals Ayutthaya and the Skothai embody a glorious artistic language and heritage, displaying Thailand's distinctive ability to absorb influences from quite different cultures. Number 5 
number five in the list is the Andaman Coast. Across on the other side of the peninsula, the Andaman Coast offers even more exemplary scenery and the finest coral reefs in the country, in particular around the Go Siliman Island chain, which ranks among the best dive sites in the world. The largest Andaman Coast island, Phuket, is one of the Thailand's top tourist destinations and graced with a dozen fine beaches, though several have been overdeveloped with a glut of high rises and taking nightlife. Number 6 in the list is Deep South. Further down the Thai Peninsula, in the provinces of the Deep South, the teeming sea life in the unfrequented sands of the Trang Islands and Koh Rato National Marine Park make this one of the Thailand's top places to go. There is now the intriguing possibility of island hooping your way down through them. In fact, all the way from Phuket to Penang in Malaysia without setting foot on mainland. The greatest interest in the deep south is currently all over the beautiful west coast, where sheer limestone outcrops, pristine sands and fish-laden coral stretch down to the Malaysian border. Number 7 in the list is Khao Yai National Park. Another regular and list of the best places to go in Thailand, Khao Yai National Park is the country's first national park that encapsulates the phenomenal diversity of Thailand, flora and fauna. It is one of the very few national parks to maintain a network of hiking trails that visitors can explore by themselves, passing dramatic waterfalls, orchards, and an abandon of wildlife. Spanning five district forest optile options and rising to a height of 1,351 meters, the park sustains over 300 bird and 20 large land mammal species, hence its UNESCO recognition as a World Heritage Site. Number 8 in the list is Isan. Few tourists visit Isan, the poorest and in some ways the most traditionally Thai region. Here, a trip through the gently modulating landscapes of the Mekong River Valley which define Thailand's northeastern extremities. It takes in archetypal agricultural villages and a fascinating array of religious sites, while the southern reaches of Isan hold some Thailand's best kept secrets, the magnificent stone temple complexes of Imai, Phanambrang, and the Khao Phra Rehem, all built by the Khmers of Cambodia almost 10 centuries ago. Number 9 in the list is Phuket. We may have already mentioned that and the main cost, but Phuket is worth looking at in a greater detail. Thailand's largest island and a province in its own right, Phuket is the wealthiest province in Thailand, with tourism driving the economy. And the number 10 in the list is Koh Samui. Despite over a million visitors a year, Koh Samui remains the top places to go in Thailand. Backpackers go boogie, fortnighters come to this part of southern Thailand for the beautiful beaches. A few kilometers across and down, Samui is generally large enough to cope with its diversity and the paradisal sands and clear blue seas have kept their good looks. So this was all about this video talking about the top 10 places of Thailand. Now if you have anything to tell us, feel free to share in the comment section. That's, that was all in this video. Thank you.